Listen, Nick Rye here. Hola, amigo. It's Herc. What you up to? Yeah, I'm, uh, I'm running some errands for the wife and kiddo. Cool, 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 cool. No doubt. So listen, man. Remember that time a couple years back we got hammered off party liquor, spread eagle, and I made you promise that if I was ever seduced by a super hot, super intelligent being of dubious moral standing who whisked me away to an exotic land, well, that you'd come and help a brother out. Uh... Vaguely. Well, bro, sis, you better buckle up because that time has arrived. Oh, shit! Herc, I really don't have time for this. But, dude, you made a promise. Do you even know what a promise is? That's like a sacred pact, man. That no hey, man shit, man. Come on, get you stupid right. gal. Herc, look, can whatever you need wait until tomorrow? I'm gonna go with the big N-O on that, compadre, because this is one of them uh, life or death things that I sometimes get myself into through no fault of my own. All right, fine. I'll help. Where do you need me to go? Uh, well, it's a little far. Don't worry. I get you here in the jiffy. What the fuck does that mean? Herc? <laughs> what the? Look, just hold on and try not to vomit. Oh, and if you got a six-pack on you, go grab it now. Herc! What the hell is going on? Oh, no, 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 no. Whatever you're doing, stop! Fuck this! What the... Oh, you gotta be kidding me! The situation is uh, rather dire. But just head through the doors, man. I'll explain everything in a minute. Whoa. Whoa. What the? Systems operating at five. What is this place, Herc? What am I doing here? Look, man, okay, there ain't always a logical explanation of these things. Sometimes you just find yourself, like, in a space station with little to no context or backstory. You just gotta fucking roll with it, man. So, less questions and more movement, Nicholas, because if you don't save us, we all gonna what? die. What? Me? What the fuck are you talking about? I swear to God, I'm gonna whoop your ass when I see you. <laughs> Good luck. Now, I know what you're thinking. Where's my junk? But as important as the answer is to that question, we got bigger fish to fry. Firstly, let me explain what's going on. You are now on Mars. Welcome. Now, imagine my arms are outstretched to comfort you during said revelation. Why are you on Mars? To save the Earth, man. What from? An alien invasion. Yeah, that's right, man. An alien invasion, amigo. Now, I'm gonna keep it 100 with you. It's not gonna be us who are doing the actual saving of Earth, it's gonna be mostly Anne. That Anne. The AI super being that Larry Parker would not stop talking about, you remember? Only problem is, man, these aliens took over the entire planet. They messed with her network, man, and she has come undone. And we need to get her back, man. So how do we return Anne to this beautiful, majestic, Earth-saving butterfly she once was? By finding energy cores and using them to power up all the terminals in the network, man. It's a simple plan, don't worry. Gotta get moving, though, man. There's a couple energy core thingies over yonder, man. I'll show you how this works. Go get them. Energy cores? Alien invasion? What the fuck, Kurt? I didn't ask for this. Look, I'm sorry, man, okay? But you're not the only person whose life has been turned upside down for far-fetched and highly suspect reasons, okay? I mean, look at me. 
If anyone's a victim here, it's me, the Herkster. Now, I don't want any part of this. I just want to go back to my family. No can do, amigo. We used that last bit of juice to get you up here. Besides, if you don't power up Ant's terminals, you won't have a family to go back to. to turn the power back on? Well, don't say it like that. Control center restored. It worked, see? Nick, this is Ann. Ann, meet my bro, Nick. Uh... Oh. Hi? Nicholas Rye, you are Earth's last hope. And me too, right? An arachnid force millions of years in the making threatens your world. But with your help, I can stop them. Yeah, Herc filled me in on that part. We turn on the terminals and restore your power and stop the alien invasion. Is there anything I'm missing here? No. Why do you ask? I don't know. Just seems pretty simple for something not so simple. You'd think there'd be more to it. No, it is very straightforward. <clears throat> Okay, man, all systems are a go. Let's get down to business. You're gonna need to be able to defend yourself out here. You see the green barrels around here? Grab what's inside them. Now, I know it just feels like space jizz or something, but this stuff is magic, Miko. Harvest is straight from the alien. It makes all sorts of cool shit out here. Take some of your space jizz over that 3D printing machine over there and I'll show you a cool trick. Voila, amigo! Welcome to the place where all your wildest dreams come true. Current designs are limited. The more you restore me, the more blueprints I can retrieve from the database. Space jizz equals firearms. Incredible. Yes. And the more my systems are restored, the more tools I can provide to obliterate any and all life forms who stand in our way. Uh, what do you mean, all life forms? Oh, you'll see when we get outside. We? Yeah, man, I ain't gonna let you hog all the glory for saving the world. This here's a partnership. Now, come on. Grab my head, dude. You got work to do. Man. This is not happening. Get a grip, Nicholas, because your brain's about to go kablooey, man. 